Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to use the Vive Tool GUI program. So you might have heard of the Vive Tool, and a lot of people use the command line version. So it's used to uh, make changes to your Windows system to enable or disable certain features. Like for example, if you want the uh, original Windows 10 style right-click menu back, you could do that. Or how to get rid of this waste of space uh, search box here to get the original icon back, because it's what we're going to demonstrate it with today. So normally you'd uh, download the Vive tool. Let's see, I got a copy of it here on the C drive. And you'd run it via the command line and you'd put in the ID, such as enable or disable with this particular ID that matches what you want to do. So if you don't want to do it that way, you could um, install the GUI and run it from there. So if you plan on using this a lot to you know, play with certain features and enable and disable things, you could do this. So once you install it, you just run it. And then what you could do, if you want to see what's available for your build, you could go to your Windows settings here. Go to about, and this is 22621. So you could find it here. Then I'll do this loading this feature name here, which takes a minute the first time you run it. Okay, then you have it broken down to categories, features that are always disabled, features that are always enabled, disabled by default, it has the IDs and modifiable features. So you know, a lot of this stuff's kind of hard to read, you know, trying to figure out what it's talking about. But what I like to use it for is for specific tools, you know, if I find the ID online. So for example, to get rid of this search box and put it back to the search icon, I know that I would need to use this ID and disable it. So rather than running the uh, command line, I could just copy this ID here and do a manually change a feature, paste it in there. And in this case, I want to deactivate because it's disable, not enable. You gotta be careful to pick the right one. So I'm gonna deactivate feature. So it says it's successful. So now I'm gonna close this out and reboot the computer because some of them you need to reboot, some of them you can just restart File Explorer, but this one you need to reboot, so I'll reboot and be right back. Okay, so we're back and rebooted, and so you can see the uh, search box is now the, the search box magnifying glass icon instead of the uh, waste of space one that we had before. So once again, you just need to know the uh, ID to enable it and disable it from the uh, Vive tool, and you could do it from the GUI if you don't want to do the command line. So I'll put a link in the description to how you could download this, and then you could have tried it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.